I'm Judy Mayer. I'm Judy Mayer. I'm Judy Mayer. We're here with Michael Arnzen. And I am standing with the star of The Evil Dead, Bruce Campbell. We're here for the Horror Channel. For the Horror Channel's Bloodline. Hi, I'm Judy Mayer for the Horror Channel. Welcome to the first episode of Bloodlines Weekly News. We're here in New York City in Manhattan's Theater District at opening night of Evil Dead the Musical. Are you original fans of the Evil Dead the film? Well, I, I hadn't heard about it until I, <laughs> until I did this job and then I started looking at all the movies and I love them, they're funny. And I am standing with the star of the Evil Dead, Bruce Campbell. So Bruce, after you saw the play, what do you think? Well, I knew how it was going to end, so it was ruined. I didn't like it at all. No, I'm kidding, of course. And now you're like legendary in the horror genre. How do you feel about that? Oh, that's okay. Y you know, I I'm an actor. I, I do, I do, it, I do whatever comes along. But this is something that it's ironic to be known most for the thing that you did when you had the least experience. Yeah. Now, Isn't that funny how that works out? Yeah, it is. Like, you know, 10 years from now, you'll look back and you go, why the hell was I on that show when I could have been in the Evil Dead musical? That's true, except I don't sing. That's okay. Hi, I'm Judy Mayer, here for the Horror Channel. We are at the 2006 Bram Stoker Awards. This is the most important night of the year for horror writers, both fiction and nonfiction. Right now, inside is the cocktail hour. We have a couple minutes before the event begins, so let's go inside and see who we can find. We're here with Michael Arnzen, who is nominated for his uh, new poetry collection called Freaksidents. There it is, Freaksidents. So where do you get all these ideas from? Uh, childhood? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a very fascinating childhood. <laughs> yeah, uh, my dad used to take me to movies. I can't believe I'm going to confess this on camera. It's okay, uh, our, our audience loves it. Excellent. We're here with the legendary Peter Straub, who is receiving the Lifetime Achievement Award. So Peter, how does it feel to be receiving this award? It feels a little like being pushed over the edge, you know, and consigned, so? consigned as, uh, you know, too old to be interesting anymore. Oh, no. But, uh, and my last question is, um, are, you, are you tired of carrying around Stephen King in your coattails? <laughs> carrying around Stephen King? <laughs> oh, I'd carry him across the river. <laughs> I think he's a wonderful guy and a great writer. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you so much, and congratulations on receiving your award tonight. You're an thank amazing you. author. Thanks a lot. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Okay. Hi, I'm Judy Mayer, here for the Horror Channel. I'm here at Nightmare's Haunted Attraction at DiPiero's Country Farm in Montvale, New Jersey. Now, every Halloween season, thousands of people come here just to get scared. Joining me now is Rich Gonzi, who's going to tell us a little bit about what goes on here. So, Rich, come and join me. Hi, how are you? I'm doing pretty good. How are you? Doing very well. So tell me, what exactly goes on here at Nightmares? Well, uh, hopefully if we do it right, we scare the pants off of everybody who comes in. <laughs> I hope you don't mean literally. <laughs> no, not literally. Hi, I'm Judy Mayer for the Horror Channel's Bloodline. I am here in New York City on 19th and Broadway at eight films to die for at the After Dark Horror Fest. Now you might be asking yourself, what is this all about? And why is it playing for only one weekend at 500 selected theaters in only 35 cities across the country? The reason is that because these films are so shocking, so graphic, and so disturbing that they cannot be shown to the general audience. So with that in mind, Let's see what the viewers have to say.